Okay, so I'm still going, but I thought I would update you. So these little squares, I cut them all up. You're thinking nine by nine, or three by three, you know, nine squares. They should all be the same. But no, every square is completely off by either a quarter to a half an inch. Like, you see how this is way taller. Some of them are way wider. Um, I have no idea how they did that because it looked all so even. So when I'm cutting trying to cut these little cards so he can glue them to the front and each card has to be a completely different measurement <laughs> I thought this was gonna be like a really quick just cut it and cut a bunch of these cards all the same um, all the same measurement and you know assembly line it no this is not gonna take me way longer than I thought so I'll finish it today but it's <laughs> it's gonna take me a while because each one has to be specifically measured. So, okay, and company, don't know what you were thinking. That wasn't smart. Um, so, yeah, I just thought I would do a little update for you. Okay, so these crazy cards are done. Look, they're all completely different sizes. That's fine. I'm going to put these in a Ziploc downstairs. So here's what we've got. We've got, I know this may sound overboard, but my, my son can be very impulsive, and it's nice to have things completely prepared. So, um, this is going to be a complete activity kit, depending on whatever he would like to do. So this is like his little apron. I'm just, this is his painting apron. Um, so I'm going to shove that in there. This is, I take old wrapping paper and use that to lay down to paint. And they're like downstairs. So there's that. <laughs> this fat little thing. 
Um, and that's for this because he might want to paint. So I'm going to toss in some paints and some, where'd they go? Oh, brushes. Okay. Paint brushes. So now Valentine's. I'm going to put these in last because they need a, a Ziploc. I don't want them, there's little pieces. So we've got the stickers. Stickers, stickers. That's for Valentine's. Um, and this, here, let's go ahead and do this here. Voila, that was fast. And I'm trying to think how this goes. Can you just flatten it out like this? I'll get my gold folder here. All right, so I'm just cutting these strips. And you'll see what it what ends up happening, supposedly. Um, let's see. So we've got those folds. Now this one has to get folded inside. So the, that makes it a heart. So what I would do is I would just take like a needle and thread and poke through all of these. And then um, sometimes you'll put like a little bead on top and it kind of keeps it down. So then you string them and they're a whole bunch of hearts. So I'm just going to cut these. Okay, so now we have Valentine activities for when he feels like doing arts and crafts. Um, I've been trying to transition my art room into mom space. <laughs> my son just seems to destroy things, and this really is kind of my way to my area to get away and therapy kind of thing. So I've been trying to make it manageable to do some crafts downstairs and not make this the only art room. So that is why I'm doing this kit. Okay, so there's that and this and our Valentine's. And we are ready. <laughs> this thing is so packed. But this will be nice. I'll put this on our mantle so with all our little hearts and Valentine's stuff that we have going on there. <laughs> it's going to stay closed. I might have to unload some of this. I don't know. Cute. Ta-da. And I'll bring this down as well. And that way we have some activities for when he is activity ready. Thanks for watching and I'll see you tomorrow for day 28.